This bridge, the Iron Workers Memorial, was the last major transportation project on the North Shore. Construction started in 1957. After 65 years, it's time for another one, and let me tell you about it. Hi, I'm Jeremy Cato, and this is the North Shore. Thanks for watching. So let's talk about BERT, the Burrard Inlet Rapid Transit. BERT goes a long way towards solving a massive range of challenges that we face here on the North Shore. BERT calls for two new SkyTrain lines. BERT Gold would run from Park Royal, 18 kilometers to Waterfront Station. BERT Purple would run from Park Royal to Metrotown in Burnaby. BERT would result in not only quick, reliable connections and dramatically reduced traffic congestion, but also lead to thousands of new affordable housing units, 43,000 full-time jobs, 2.7 billion in wages and salaries, decreased pollution, and add $4.2 billion to Canada's GDP. BERT is a no-brainer. BERT first came to light in late 2021. Since then, the three North Shore local governments and the two First Nations have petitioned, have implored TransLink to give it the go-ahead. TransLink said no, even though BERT projects to be among the top performing projects considered for Transport 2050. And here's the rub. TransLink's new 10-year vision points to SkyTrain extensions elsewhere, but not here. The BERT study notes that the North Shore is the last large population region in the entire Lower Mainland without rapid transit or light rail. North Shore councils have not pushed forcefully enough to get this project done. I want to change that and I'm asking for your help. I plan to run for North Vancouver City Council in the fall and I will make BERT one of my top priorities. Please, together, let's get this done. Thanks for watching. I'm Jeremy Cato, and this is The North Shore.